Somebody had a question about inner thighs. Now, women, I know the inner thighs, especially the upper inner thighs, are something that we always want to work out. Um, this is one of the exercises that I have found the most effective. There's something called hip abduction and adduction at the gym. Um, it's a machine, and it's the thing where you're sitting and your legs are going in and out. Um, depends on where the pads are, whether it's adduction or abduction. Um, however, you don't need those machines. You can do this at home. Just a simple exercise ball. Um, it does not matter on the size of the exercise ball. Um, usually, smaller exercise balls are better for this, but they can be too small. This is too small. The reason why is you want the ball to be able to hit the ground and be able to stabilize itself on the ground while it's in between the knee area. What you're going to do is very simple, and I don't know if you can see this motion, okay? But I'm actually working my inner thighs right now. I'm squeezing and relaxing. Squeezing and relaxing. Okay? I don't know. Can you see that? Okay. So again, squeeze, relax. Squeeze. Now, a few times what you might want to do is to increase the intensity is just hold that. Okay? Hold the squeeze, hold the tension as long as you can. Okay? You're going to feel a burning pain. It is normal to feel a burning pain. If you're feeling any type of sharp pain when you're doing any type of muscle workout, you need to stop. Um, it's your body's way of telling you that you need to stop. However, if you're feeling burning, if you're feeling shaking, if you're feeling like you are not able to move the muscle, that's what you want, believe it or not. There's that saying, no pain, no gain, and I think this is where it comes from.